Billy Hall Jr. is a successful part of the Hall Restaurant Group. In this edition of Quentin's Post Ups, I speak exclusively with Billy Jr. one-on-one. -on -one. And be sure to download the free Quentin's Post Ups app in your Apple or Google Play stores. Mr. Billy Hall. <laughs> the man of the legend. Quentin, Quentin, baby. How are you? Good, how are you? Oh, I'm doing just great, actually. Thanks for having me on. Oh, anytime. You know, as we sit here right now, we're sitting in one of your restaurants for the Hall Restaurant Group, uh, High Cotton. Yes, sir. And you were just talking to me about it just a few seconds ago, but the extension of Charleston Restaurant Week. Yeah, we're, we're, we love it. I mean, we should do it the whole month of September, I think. Mm. Um, unfortunately, we had the scary situation with the hurricane. And, right. And um, we were so fortunate here in Charleston to not have it hit us, but um, so many others in the state have been affected. And um, we decided um, as, a, as a family to extend it a week, but uh, I think the whole Charleston it's a good decision to extend another week as well. So we're here and I got me a little filet coming for you right yeah, now. Yeah, thank you. Thank you Absolutely. so much. Little mashed potatoes. <laughs> That's right. And green beans. Yes, sir. Yeah. And you, you talk about Florence. I'm wondering how did the whole restaurant group approach that threat to us here at Charleston? Well, we, we just listened to the governor's um, Tuesday evacuation orders. And we didn't let any of our staff that need to get away and get out of here go and do what they got to do. Um, we did stay open for a couple of days. Um, just to feed those here in town, and then some of our servers that wanted to stay didn't want to leave. Um, they all stayed and worked, um, so we we're fortunate we didn't have to close the whole way. Right. But uh, first, it's just you know really safety, making sure everybody's ready to get out and get to where they need to be with their families. So. That, that's right. And you talk about family. I got to talk to you about your brother. Absolutely, Mr. Tommy Hall Jr. You just got married. That's right. How's life with him now? <laughs> I think it's I think it's good. He's, there's a little hectic for a while. Mm -hmm. The wedding, but he's he's excited, real happy. We're yeah. happy for him. Yeah. My mom, my mom and dad are real happy. So that's the key, and, and her parents are real happy. So. And you talk about your father. Obviously, he was in a, a little accident in the upstate a couple of weeks ago. Yes, sir. Where is he right now? How is he? I don't, I don't know how many dads have been in a plane accident, survived it, and then married their son two weeks later. Right. So when I was giving my my uh, best man toast, yeah. I had to had to have him stand up. And everybody <laughs> got a good laugh out of that. We um, were fortunate. He. he um, a little small plane. Um, he and his good friend were flying up there for meetings up at our halls in Greenville, right. and uh, it was it was a little bit wet. And they just um, unfortunately um, um, came in too hard on the runway. Mm -hmm. uh, he didn't give it enough depth, and uh, they're they're alive. At least we can laugh and yeah. talk about it. And um, he said they keep trying to keep dirt on him, but he's still alive. So we're we're we're, we're very lucky and very fortunate. Yeah, thank God he is alive. Thank God, absolutely. Well, fact, my brother's a, you know, talking about my brother, we, he and I were roommates for the last 11 years, so I'm, I'm the, the single guy with, with no roommate anymore, so. <laughs> but it's football season now, Absolutely. man. Absolutely. Well, it's, it's, uh, it's fun. We're, we're still, he still hasn't moved all the items out of the house yet, so. <laughs> oh, wow. I said, it's my place now, you can get everything out of here. <laughs> and you, obviously, you know, you talk about Halls Greenville, now it's Halls Columbia. Yes, yeah, sir, we're, we're, we're building there right now. Wow. Tommy just stopped in today and took a bunch of pictures. Uh, we're shooting for the end of November. Oh, really? We're really looking forward to it. Um, I know that's your, yes. that's your hometown. Right? Well, yeah, Charles is your hometown. Home, yeah. well, I would love to live there in Columbia. live downtown right there on Main Street. Yeah, right there. Look at the Capitol. Yeah. That's Just right. Come work with us. Come on. Well, I'll see what I can do. Let's go. Yeah. I can't lose you in Charles. No. Well, I don't know how that's going to go. But I do want like a condo where I can live in on Main Street and just look, overlook the Capitol. Let's do it. Okay. We're going to be right there near you. Yes, 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 yes. We what? expect you there. Oh, I'll, I'll be there for first day. Look forward to it. Thank yeah, you. man. Anytime. So what's next for the whole restaurant group and your family? Well, we're just, you know, trying to do a great job with our spots here. You know, we we're fortunate this High Cotton's been here quite a while. Yeah. We took it over a few years back, and, and we're just trying to improve it on a daily day basis. And we've got a great staff. You met some of them already. Right. And uh, we're really excited about the future here and Snob right across the street. Sweet. We put a brand new kitchen in there uh, in January, wow. and, and you can see the new door on the front there. Right. And, and uh, we love having both these right here next to each other. Um, yeah. We wish all our restaurants were right real close, but we have Rita's out on the beach. Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to go out there tonight and watch the football games. And, and uh, so excited about that. And, you know, the beach isn't as packed now, so it's yeah. easier to get in and out of there. But uh, we're excited about the Right now, we're just trying to do a great job of what we have and what we're building. We're also building the halls in next and uh, up in Somerville. Oh, that's right. I forgot so about that. That's, that's uh, going to be probably the spring of, of 2019. Oh, cool. So that's coming right around the corner as well. So. Oh, so many great things happening here. Well, we're having fun, and we're lucky to be here in this town, too. Charleston's the best. Yes, indeed. I agree completely. Well, I don't know what the city would do without you. Ah! <laughs> well, thank you greatly. You're such an amazing job, really. I mean, your energy and, and what these interviews, and, and you get around so, so many people and touch yeah. so many people. Yeah. You should be in uh, work for the mayor. Well, <laughs> 
<laughs> Which mayor? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess you got Columbia. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. Yeah, you have to Greenville sometimes. Check it out too. Greenville's amazing. Yeah, I'm really, happy to do that. Really growing area. Yeah. It's and it's because of you guys too. Well, no, we just happen to be a part of it. Greenville's a fast. I mean, we've had a lot of. I think we have about seven or eight servers now right. that have moved from Charleston Falls and then up in Greenville. Wow. They love it up there. Our general manager, she used to work here at yeah. Icon for She worked at Halls for yeah. almost four years, and now she's up there and working in Greenville. Wow, so amazing. So great to hear. Well, we love it. The states. Well, I was I was born here. My parents, when they first moved, first got married, they moved from Washington D.C. here to to, to, oh. to Charleston. And Dad worked at the uh, Mills House Hotel, yeah. and then he got transferred to the Hyatt in, oh. in Hillman. And my brother and I were both born in Butte. Oh, you know, and Tommy's a Clemson boy. Yeah, and my sister who lived in San Francisco, she yeah. went to college Charleston. Ah. so she's she's a, she's kind of the one that brought us all back here. What? After twenty three moves, my parents said they don't want to move anymore, and they wanted to live right here and do the restaurants here. Mm. So we we. Uh, we're having fun just being back in Charleston, Charleston. in the low country. Oh, that's so great to hear. Well, uh, Billy Hall Jr., thank you so much for your time. I really, really appreciate this. Thank you. Really appreciate what this. Oh, I love watching your stuff every week. <laughs> thank I you. Can't, you. Can't, never know who you're going <laughs> to It's always a secret, right? <laughs> it's amazing things. Well, thank you. It's all the grace of God. Well, you're part of our family. So, oh, thank you. Need, that's what we base our restaurants on, family and, and um, you know, touching people and how, how I hope we can make their day better. That's right. And, you know, um, Everybody's comes in from all different walks of life. Right. We're so lucky that the tourism here in the city and what yeah. Mayor Riley started. Right. And what all our all the other great restaurants do in this town to make people want to come back. Uh, there's so many great hotels and restaurants. I mean, it's amazing. I mean, hotels are being built and yeah. restaurants opening up. So That's right. We're just happy to be a part of it. That's so great to hear. Well, well, thank you for this. Thank you. Anything you ever need in any of our locations, let us know. I will. Thank you greatly. Thank you, absolutely. Yeah, man. Good to see you. You too. You're going to enjoy this delay. Oh, that's right. Coming up soon. (laughs) I'm ready. I'm hungry.